what you okay. So when we're measuring wrist extension, we have three options. We can line the goniometer up with the fifth metacarpal. I want you to let your hand come back. No, let your fingers be bent. Okay, so I can line it up with the fifth metacarpal, where I'm using that and the ulna, or I can line it up with the second metacarpal, which I'm going to feel exactly where it is, and use the radius and the second metacarpal. The problem with that is you'll notice, if you look at the hand, the fifth metacarpal is further back, or the second metacarpal is further back when you're doing flexion or extension, depending, it's because of the um, arches of your hand. So a more accurate measure may be to go right in the middle and lay it pretty much alongside the third metacarpal or right between the fingers and measure like that for wrist extension. And if we were doing wrist flexion, it would be on the dorsum of the hand right along the third metacarpal.